Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can save and share a workbook to a shared network location or online. You can save and share a workbook online using OneDrive, OneDrive for Business, or SharePoint. Sharing workbooks online allows multiple users to access a copy of the workbook to make changes. When you share a workbook, users will not be accessing the workbook and making changes simultaneously. Instead, each user makes changes to a copy of the shared workbook when they open it. Changes made by other users are merged back into the original workbook after the users have finished making changes in their copy of the shared workbook. There are, however, a few tips you should be aware of before you share a workbook. After sharing a workbook, you will not be able to insert or change any of the following objects or settings until you have stopped sharing the workbook. These include merged cells, conditional formatting, data validation, charts, pictures, objects, drawing objects, hyperlinks, scenarios, outlines, subtotals, data tables, pivot table reports, workbook and worksheet protection, slicers, sparklines, XML data, and macros. Therefore, insert or apply these things prior to sharing the workbook if needed. Several other Excel features may also be temporarily disabled until the workbook has stopped being shared. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.